New evidence tonight in the story behind the groom who claimed he had terminal cancer. Barbara Jones Leiden says she's convinced Boyer used her to pay for his lifestyle and love affairs. She sat down with News 6 investigator Mike Holfeld. You thought you'd found your soulmate? We just got along so well. Barbara Jones Leiden wants the public to know she was in love with an alleged romance con man. But he not only stole my heart, he stole a lot of my hopes and dreams. Besides the money. The money? $22,000 she loaned to 60-year-old Ken Robert Boyer to pay for what he claimed were cancer treatments. First it was the kidney, then it was the liver, then it was miraculously cured, and then there was a lull. She has the canceled checks and a promissory note, but no actual medical bills. Now she's filed a lawsuit to get all that money back. So the illness was an act, or was it real? I don't, to this day, still don't know. Will you give her promise? Yes, I will. Yes, I surely will. What we do know is Ken Boyer was supposed to have stage four liver cancer that day he married his long lost love in Palm Bay, Florida. The story and his will to live became an internet sensation. It's tough for me to have to Accept this, but I have. I'm ready. I've had a really good life. God's been good to me. And if this is my time, then it's my time. That was 24 days ago. Since then, News 6 has uncovered a romance subplot. Allegations by women from Miami to Tampa, all claiming Ken Boyer was dating them. There was even talk of marriage, they say. They all connected on singleparentmeet.com. Boyer's own cell phone bills confirm he was in contact with all of them. Ironically, Barbara Jones Layden, the woman he was living with here, paid that phone bill every month. He's just a very selfish man. It's hooray for me and screw you. That's, that's his motto. In a text to News 6, Boyer writes, I'm not denying that they know me. I've dated them all. I do not intend to justify any of this. Why should I? Did he con you? In hindsight, yeah. News 6 has confirmed Ken Boyer and his wife, Michelle Kimbrell, are now living in Farmington, Missouri, on land Boyer owns. As for his medical prognosis, that remains unclear. Our investigation continues. Mike Hofeld, News 6. Now, Boyer's 20-year-old daughter, Hannah, tells News 6 her father claimed he would not make it to his next birthday. Ken Boyer turns 61 on June 4th.